just a quick update and um, I'm on cycle day eight today and it has been officially one whole week since uh, my mis miscarriage and the surgery um, to remove the pregnancy and um, I'm feeling a lot better this week not as emotional I still get very emotional from time to time it sort of comes in waves so I can be okay one day then the next I'm not but then I'm fine after after I've had a cry I'm fine but I feel a lot lot better um, this week um, I have ordered some pregnancy tests as I want to know when the hormone is out my body so I will either get them tomorrow or Monday and I, I'm going to take one obviously to see if it's negative or if it is still positive then I'll have to keep taking them till I do get a negative and then once I've got a negative I should know I will obviously hopefully very soon after that um, we are hoping and praying that we do um, get pregnant again this first month so we don't want we don't want to wait we want it to happen straight away so I'm keeping our fingers crossed that it does happen hopefully this month if not hopefully next month um, yeah so not much much report really we I'm going to see a psychic actually on next uh, next Wednesday I think it is, next, yeah next Wednesday going to see a psychic in the evening so I'm hoping she's going to be able to tell me something whether you know we'll conceive or I don't know because she told me about the pregnancy that we've just lost she never told me we'd lose it though that, that's what that's what I don't understand but I did see her the month I was pregnant I didn't know I was pregnant yet but she told me I was so <laughs> I went home and then a week later I tested and found out I was pregnant so she was right about that but she never said anything about losing the baby or anything along that line so I'm not too sure this next time when, when I go but I'm hoping she tells us again you know that we will conceive and I'm hoping she's right so she hasn't been very wrong before she's been brilliant her name's Janet Wilson. She uh, she has her own Facebook page and website, and she's she's amazing. She's on this website called FreeIndex.com. She is rated number one in the UK, so she has to be good. And she has been extremely, you know, spot on in everything she's told me in the past. And I've been about six times. And so yeah, we're going next week. So I will do another video on. Well, we'll be seeing a Wednesday evening, about quite late on in the evening. So I'll probably do another video on Thursday and put that up just to let you know what she said. If she said anything to do with conceiving and pregnancy, I will do a video and update you. And I'll also hopefully try and do a video when I take my t pregnancy test, which will either be... Well, it's probably going to be Monday, that will. Um, just to show you what it's like. I'm hoping it's going to be negative or a really faint positive because I just want the hormone gone. I want us to be able to start again. So I'll do them. So that's two two videos. Hopefully that will come up next week for you to have a look at. Um, don't think there's much more to report. Just cycle day. Uh, hopefully, again, like I say, I'll get a BFN and I'll ovulate soon and we can try and conceive again so keeping my fingers crossed but yeah uh, so hopefully yeah look out for another video on Monday and that will be the pregnancy test so hoping fingers crossed it sounds silly doesn't it fingers crossed it's a BFN but yeah keep your eye out on that and uh, I'll see you all then